Hi guys, it's Harvey from All Parts. Well, I've been, I'm really excited to get in this. I didn't want to post something until next week, but I figured I'd post it. Um, I finally got it in, and it's called a hot stick. Let me see if I can find it. I might put it on one of my specials. There it is. It's called a hot stick. Now, years ago, and I forget the, the name of the hot tub. I have a small, small pack, and basically the hot tub had a sensor in the um, wet bay, and um, actually in the wet bay of the tub, and sensed temperature. Well, the only heat came from what we called the red end, all right, and the pump, what it did at the end of the pump the wet end was actually red and it was called the hot wet end due to friction okay it made heat there was no heating element in this hot tub and everything else like that the company went out of business it was really a good hot tub the problem is you couldn't work on it you had a little tiny door I mean a little tiny door barely could get the pump in and the pack was garbage naturally I mean it Looked like a $20 pack. But anyway, so they got rid of the pump because they just burned themselves out due to friction. But if you got an inch and a half, um, either um, a Whirlpool bath, if you got a hot tub, I'm telling you guys I'm excited about this. Even if you can capable of putting this on your hot tub, pump one. Then when it turns on, it, you know, heats the thing. What it does, it makes not free energy. And no, there's nothing like free energy. Okay, what they say, nothing's free in this world. But what this does, it, it capitates the water in such a way that it heats, heats the molecules of the water up by bubbles. You know, um, so I'm trying to get a better picture, but it's just this. So when the pump is pumping, it's blowing through these, and it's causing friction in the water, which causes heat. Now, I'm not saying you're going to heat your 300-gallon hot tub up, you know, um, with this, but even if you save yourself, say the average hot tub, double pole, 50 amp break it, on average, it's 30 to $50, depending how high you set it um, on standby. But even if it saves you $5 a month, okay, and you're capable of putting that on pump number one, war your whirlpool bath in your house. This is an excellent application for your whirlpool bath. Women used to always say, well, you know, if I could get another 10 or 15 minutes, it would be nice. This may just get you another 10 or 15 minutes because you are starting with hot water and a whirlpool bath is a lot of water flow and that's what you want is a lot of water flow. Okay. Um, now, on a bigger hot tub, granted, it's usually number one pump is a dual speed, and you're running on low. Are you going to create that much heat due to cavitation and everything else like that? Not really. But once you put it on, on high and everything else like that, you're in a hot tub. You're only supposed to be in a hot tub for 15 minutes, but let me tell you. My wife... Used to stay in Oz for an hour and a half, two hours, and drink, which you're not supposed to do. So, like I said, even if this saves you five dollars a month, putting this little simple thing on will save you money. So, basically, it's free energy. You run in the pump anyway, okay? It's free energy. I got it. I hear rumors that they're going to make a coupling so it'll fit on. This is a glue end slip for inch and a half. So this goes on the pump, comes with a gasket. There's your nut, 
it's through it in there. Um, if it's Schedule 40 PVC pipe, it's going to be hard. But if it's flex pipe, it's going to be easy fix. I said even if it saves you $5 a month. In two months, it paid for itself. All right, guys. Again, this is Harvey from All Parts Pool and Spa. Trying to save you some guys some money. It does work. They got rid of the hot um, hot wet end motor pump for that particular hot tub. So they made a stick. And I know it does work. I have seen it work. It does work. You got to, I mean, in theory, you can start with cold water, run the pump on high, and in two or three days with the cover on, you will generate heat. Um, probably hot enough where you can get in. The old round ones that used to be with the motor took about two or three days to come up. But they did work. The hot tubs did sell. Um, this doesn't re really restrict the um, motor at all. I like it. So on this one, I give it two thumbs up, which I usually don't give anything two thumbs up. All right, guys, just a quick little tip to um, hopefully save yourself some money. Um, but that's it. Try it. See, let me know how you like it. Take care. Well, if you did get it, um, let me know, know how it's working for you. Take care, guys. Bye.